You are about to enter a world of immaturity where people will drink and smoke just to be popular. Advertisements have caused people to do many things that they don't want to do. People are sheep. They follow whatever they see. Today we follow the afternoon of one such teenager. Christopher James Malcolm. He was bored after school one day and just wanted to watch TV. But advertisements aren't as harmless as they used to be. I've come to talk to you about something very serious. Alcohol advertisement directed towards teens. On TV lately, there's been more and more advertisements directed towards teens, and I've compiled some facts to prove this. 22 of 211 ads were placed in magazines that on average only 12 to 20 year olds read. Also in 2004, that alcohol advertisement has increased by 15%. And this increase has caused 44% of kids to drink in high school and 22% of kids to drink in middle school. That's outrageous. Why drink soda? Drink beer. Chris didn't have to drink. He saw something on TV and instantly wanted to try it. Now he's wandering through the neighborhood not having a clue what he was doing. Hey everybody! I got shoes for hands! You couldn't focus, you couldn't walk straight, and you couldn't even see the car that was coming right for him. Maybe if there wasn't so many pressuring advertisements, something so tragic wouldn't have had to happen. His bad judgment led to his own demise. Don't drink soda. <laughs> Wait, no, 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 no. Go. Dude, he's calling someone. Just go. No, I'm calling. No, I drink no, soda. No. Drink beer. <laughs> Why drink soda? 
drink beer. <laughs> no, keep going, keep going, keep going. <laughs> Go with it. <laughs> keep it going, keep it going. Fun. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Just go! Roll the window up. Alright, oh, show me Go! Okay, you can't do that. Stop it. That's not how you were. <laughs> now just stay there for like five minutes. <laughs> 